What up, guys? It's your girl, Manic Meeks, and I am back with more Mass Effect. I feel like this is going towards the end of the game, so I am preparing some libations for me to enjoy in this situation. Just a little. I still have a lot of stuff to do. So, I'm going to go ahead and, you know, crack my Pepsis open for my... Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> I pushed a button. Um, and then, you know... Get my life together, but if you're enjoying anything on my channel, gameplays, reviews, reactions, whatever else I got going on, go ahead and subscribe. I'm here, you're here. Let's be here together, guys. This is so much fun. This is so, so much fun. Just go ahead and just, you know, go even hold. Okay. I'm so glad I'm off tomorrow morning. But what I did not do, let me just take this time to go ahead and lubricate my situation and get my lights together because I'm looking at my camera and I forgot to turn on lights and I was like why do I look so strange because there's no lights in the background uh, let's do this color why not cool so get rid of that and that all right is that part? what is this Oh, there was really people there. I thought I was facing the wrong direction. I thought I, I thought I, oh, we had to go back. Yeah, we can't go through this door. Yeah, 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 yeah. Are the guns still gunning? Go ahead and turn this up. I don't, I don't think I need to change anything, but I'm going to go through and take a look. 60, we're good there, 370. Uh -huh. I got rid of a lot, I need to get rid of more. Oh, these are all the same. We're good. There's only one of those. We're all good there. Okay, let's see. We're okay with that. I wish I had some more armor for her. Oh, I do. It's 23. But that's it, huh? Mm, okay. Technically, it is more, and I think I am the highest that I have for me. Hmm. Okay. Let's go ahead and save. All right, let's go. this oh geez oh sir that way you can at least shoot what you want to hit Always do that. Try to use my powers more.
Damn! There's somebody behind us. Who's behind us? Did you charge up? Can't she throw him? Dang it! Thank you! There's somebody over- oh, it's over there. Who is- somebody else? I don't see that person, but I see the fire coming from them. Always important. Wow. Thanks. Um. I see you, but I can't get to you. Where? The, where is this place? Hold on, this is huge. Okay. Um. What was that? Um. Uh, there we go. It still feels like the sound's a little low in my ears. So. Oh, okay, hold on. Let me. Can we map it? Is this a. Elevator. Okay, so I'm just, uh, there's, there's too many places for me to go and I'm just overwhelmed of which direction. So let me double check over here one more time. There's nothing, okay. There's a downstairs to my right. There's another pathway to my left. There's some bad guys behind me. Like, why are these... These things are weird. Like, what are these? Oh, I'm saving. Oh, no, we're not saving. We're not doing that. I don't like the fact that you saved when I came around the corner. See, there's somebody else. And now the battle music came back on. I went around the corner and it stopped, so. Bitch! Okay. Okay, see, there's a whole lot. Yikes! Whoa, 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 whoa! Okay, that was behind us. Jeez. Oh my gosh, this thing. He dead though. Holy crap. I have no idea which direction. Hopefully I get to explore all of this. I don't wanna accidentally go the right way. Um these things are really weird looking. They're literally like stuck in their little wheelchairs. Okay, somebody's playing the game in their wheelchairs. I see you. 
Oh. That was long. I don't know what that was for. I, I, there's somebody else. <laughs> Jesus! That scared the mess out of me! Oh! Gosh, that scared the mess out of me. Wow, that literally scared the crap out of me. Is this the downside? From the uh, the other direction? Wow, that literally scared the shit out of me. Hey! <coughs> Excuse me. Yeah, this is. Okay, cool. So that was the right way. Wait, does that make the elevators work? No, it did not. I just don't feel safe without my right gun out. Sorry. I'm gonna put my gun out. It's my baby. Why are you just sitting in the middle, sir? What is this? It's so weird. But why do we have all these pathways that go nowhere? Oh, it's so weird. I just have a feeling that they're gonna get up and I'm gonna have to fight them on the way back. Because they are literally sitting in our little wheelchairs. Close your boat. Okay, got that one. I missed. This thing be laying people down. You are going to go to sleep, sir. I know you tired. Be quiet and go to sleep. Ears itching. Oh shit! I didn't even expect you to be there. I was not even looking. No, 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 no! Okay, see, ya. can we jump over these things? Probably not, but that was just pretty funny. Okay. Oh, that works. Oh, I can go up that way. Anything? the fuck is that noise? I don't like it because it sounds like somebody giggled. Oh, that's the elevator open? Okay, uh-huh. Uh, 
Okay. This is a door. What's this for? Oh, this is an elevator. Okay, so these are all... So, mm. Why we gotta put our weapons up in the elevator? I don't understand that. So this is just to grab this thing over here. Okay, so now I can go up here and go into this other elevator, which would hopefully take me somewhere else, right? We're going down, okay. I was wondering, I was like, can I see where we're going? This place still has power. It must be running off its own generator. I bet this is the command center for the entire complex. Seren's troops must have sealed the doors from here after we went inside. We'll have to figure out how to disengage the security lockdown if we ever want to get inside that bunker. Oh, it moved to save. Speaking of which, maybe I should save. I should, like, actually save. And then I should also go into my equipment. Thanks. I don't think I got anything that's higher than what I got now. Please. Yeah, I don't think I got any extra armor for him. they all just like I knew it I knew it I, wa I knew it why did I even play games that's why you missed you're hitting your friends Oh, he literally yeeted him. <laughs> he didn't even need my sound effect. You literally yeeted him. Congratulations. I'm so proud of you. I always... Wait, are we dead now? Is everybody done? I always forget to use that. And the worst thing about these enemies is that they run at you. I don't like it when you run at me. It's scary. So I can go up. Okay, we're not going up just yet. Turn around the corner Around the country What does this do?
Are those for me? Is that what these do? Wake these guys up? But they're my friends. Okay. You are my friends. Okay, I need you to move. I'm gonna um, wake up everybody that I can because you're giving me the option to. the container over there. This is an up. Let me get this container. And then I'll go up, I guess. Dang! Like, listen, I need a container to have more stuff. Okay. Let's go, let's go up. Peek around these pointers. Okay, okay. Other than that corner, I see the security panel. What does this do? Come on, Seren's already got a head start. We have to go find him before he reaches the conduit. Unless he's already found it. And we're just walking into a trap. Hmm. That's a chance we'll have to take. Amen. We're gonna have to. Hold on. Something's happening. Too late. Unable to invading fleets. No escape. What? Sounds like some kind of message. But I don't recognize the language. It's probably in Prothean. This recording must be fifty thousand years old. No wonder we can't understand it. The message is all broken up, but I recognize some of the words. It's a warning against the Reaper invasion. Incredible! The cipher must have transferred an understanding oh, of the Prothean language into your mind. Not safe. Seek refuge inside the archives. Inside the archives. What's it saying? Can you make out anything useful? Fought Reapers. The Citadel. The Citadel. It said something about the conduit, but it's too degraded to help. We should go. We cannot be stopped. Cannot be stopped. Cannot be stopped. Oh, I can still go up somewhere? Oh, no. Oh, well. Nope, I was hoping there was something over here or something like that. Okay, I know, I know you guys are sick of me. You gotta be sick of me. Wasn't there, oh, I can go down, right? Or is that, no, that was this, okay. Squad. My barriers go up. Wow, I got a lot of these. What 
Let's do that, shall we? Um... But I also want to know... Security panel... Oh, that way. Is it still up, though? Maybe I missed it. Let me go back. So maybe I... Wait, which direction? This direction. Oh, yeah, this way. Have me out here naked. Watch you start shooting. It's gonna pew pew me. Okay, that's down. Something over there, something down below. back where I was, right? This is back in the beginning. No, no, I don't want to go this way. This is back in the beginning. Right? I don't want to go this way, right? Or did I open it? So I guess the door should be open, right? Because we were doing this to open the door. I'm definitely taking the vehicle. I don't like that you saved. I'm gonna save myself. You don't tell me what to do. Nah. Or we just haven't run into it yet. Yep. Give it a second, so I'm finna drop down and get his eagle on right in front of us. Ride, 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 hitching a ride. Let's go! It is. Oh, I thought I could turn. Continue. Pops. Mother, I didn't even see you guys, so it's too late. Look at you. Oh no! This is my, this is me 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 driving and trying to to shoot. It's not you. I promise, it's not you. I don't even see you. Where you guys at? Where you at? Where you at? Where you at? Oh. <laughs> That was petty. Um, what's that? It's gonna stop my car. What's happening? It's a trap. Saren must have set an ambush. I don't think Saren's behind this. I gotta get out of my car. Okay. I'm gonna save. All right, here we go. If this 
were simply an automated trap, Xeran would have triggered it. What do you think this is? Don't get your hopes up. The only thing we can depend on right now is ourselves. Um, I know there's, you know, I know, but I'm still gonna have my gun out. Vigil? You are not Prothean, but you are not machine either. This eventuality was one of many that was anticipated. This is why we sent our warning through the beacons. Um... Looks like some kind of VI program. Pretty badly damaged. I do not sense the taint of indoctrination upon any of you. Unlike the other that passed recently. Oh. Perhaps there is still hope. Wait a minute. How come I can understand you? Why aren't you speaking the Prothean language? I have been monitoring your communication since you arrived ah. at this facility. I have translated my output into a format you will comprehend. My name is Vigil. Hi, Vigil. You are safe here for the moment, but that is likely to change. Soon, nowhere will be safe. Are you some kind of artificial intelligence program? I am an advanced non-organic analysis system with personality imprints from Kesad Aishan, chief overseer of the Ilos research facility. Why did you bring me here? You must break a cycle that has continued for millions of years. But to stop it, you must understand, or you will make the same mistakes we did. The Citadel is the heart of your civilization and the seat of government, as it was with us and as it has been with every civilization that came before us. But the Citadel is a trap. The station is actually an enormous mass relay, one that links to dark space, the empty void beyond the galaxy's horizon. Mm -hmm. When the Citadel Relay is activated, the Reapers will pour through, and all you know will be destroyed. How come nobody ever noticed the Citadel was an inactive mass relay? The Reapers are careful to keep the greatest secrets of the Citadel hidden. That is why they created a species of seemingly benign organic caretakers. The Keepers Bruh. maintain the station's most basic functions. They enable any species that discovers the Citadel to use it without fully understanding the technology. Wow. Reliance on the Keepers ensures no other species will ever discover the Citadel's true nature. Not until the Relay is activated and the Reapers invade. Will we have to fight them? How do the Reapers survive out in dark space? We have only theories. The researchers here came to believe the Reapers enter prolonged states of inactivity to conserve energy. This allows them to survive the thousands and thousands of years it takes for organic civilization to rebuild itself. But in this state, they are vulnerable. By retreating beyond the edges of the galaxy, they ensure no one will accidentally discover them. They keep their existence hidden until the Citadel relay is activated. So now we gotta go back to the Citadel. I think that's it for that. The Reapers can wipe out the Council and the entire Citadel fleet in a single surprise attack. That was our fate. Our leaders were wow. dead before we even realized we were under attack. The Reapers seized control of the Citadel and through it the mass relays. Communication and transportation across our empire were crippled. Each star system was isolated, cut off from the others. Easy prey for the Reaper fleets. Over the next decades, the Reapers systematically obliterated our people. World wow. by world, system by system, they methodically wiped us out. The war was lost. If you'd surrendered, they might have let you live. No offer of surrender. Wow. Was our enemy had a single goal. The extinction of all advanced organic life. Through the Citadel, the Reapers had access to all our records, maps, census data. Information is power, and they knew everything about us. Their fleets advanced across every settled region of the galaxy. Some worlds were utterly destroyed. Others were conquered, their populations enslaved. These indoctrinated servants became sleeper agents under Reaper control. 
taken in as refugees by other Protheans. They betrayed them to the machines. Within a few centuries, the Reapers had killed or enslaved every Prothean in the galaxy. They were relentless, brutal, and absolutely thorough. I don't understand. Where did the Reapers go after they conquered your people? Our worlds were stripped bare, harvested by Jeez. the indoctrinated slaves. Everything of value, all resources, all technology was taken. Certain that all advanced organic life had been extinguished. The Reapers retreated back through the Citadel relay into Dark So they just wait for the it behind them. So they just wait for the organizations to or the All evidence of the Reaper invasion had been not organizations. Away. Only their indoctrinated slaves were left behind, abandoned. Mindless husks, no longer capable of independent thought. The indoctrinated soon starved or died of exposure. The genocide of the Protheans was complete. So they do this every couple thousands of years where they let a society build itself up, stretch itself over the galaxy, and then they come through and fuck it up royally and take all the, and take every, like everything from them, all the resources, everything. And then they go back and they wait for it to do it again. Wow. What do the Reapers get out of this? Why do they keep repeating this pattern of genocide over and over? The Reapers are alien, unknowable. Perhaps they need slaves or resources. Hmm. More likely they are driven by motives and goals organic beings cannot hope to comprehend. In the end, what does it matter? Your survival depends on stopping them, not in understanding them. Truth. You said you brought me here for a reason. Tell me what I need to do. The conduit is the key. Before the Reapers attacked, we Protheans were on the cusp of unlocking the mysteries behind mass relay technology. Ilos was a top secret facility. Here, researchers worked to create a small scale version of a mass relay, one that linked directly to the Citadel, the hub of the relay network. The conduit's not a weapon, it's a back door onto the Citadel. How did you manage to stay hidden? All official records of our project were destroyed in the initial attack on the Citadel. While the Prothean Empire came crashing down, Ilos was spared. Ah. We severed all communication with the outside, and our facility went dark. The personnel retreated underground into these arcs. So they're still here. To conserve resources, everyone was put into cryogenic stasis. I was programmed to monitor the facility and wake the staff when the danger had passed. But the genocide of an entire species is a long story <gasps> process. So they're all dead? Years passed, decades, centuries. The Reapers persisted, and my energy reserves were dwindling. You should have fought. We were a few hundred against a galactic invasion fleet. Our only hope was to remain undetected. I began to disable the life support of non-essential personnel. First support staff, then security. One by one, their pods were shut down to conserve energy. Eventually, only the stasis pods of the top scientists remained active. Even these were in danger of failing when the Reapers finally retreated back through the Citadel relay. There were hundreds of stasis pods out there. You just shut them down and you killed them? It's not, I mean, I understand, but... You were programmed to protect them, not kill them. This outcome was not completely unforeseen. My actions were a result of contingency programming entered on my creation. I bet they didn't tell the non-essential staff about this contingency. I saved key personnel. When the Reapers retreated, the top researchers were still alive. My actions are the only reason any hope remains. When the researchers woke, they realized the Prothean species was doomed. There were only a dozen individuals left, far too few to sustain a viable population. Yet they vowed to find some way to stop the Reapers from returning. A way to break the cycle forever. And they knew the Keepers were the key. So, is it a good thing that we helped old dude with the Keepers? I still don't understand what's going on here. Why is Saren trying to find the conduit? The conduit gives him access to the Citadel and the Keepers. 
The keepers are controlled by the Citadel. Before each invasion, a signal is sent through the station compelling the keepers to activate the Citadel relay. After decades of feverish study, the scientists discovered a way to alter this signal. Using the conduit, they gained access to the Citadel and made the modifications. This time, when Sovereign sent the signal to the Citadel, the Keepers ignored it. The Reapers are trapped in dark space. Saren must have some plan to undo everything you did. The one you call Saren will use the conduit to bypass the Citadel's defenses. Once inside, he will transfer control of the station to Sovereign. Oh. Sovereign will override the Citadel systems and manually open the relay and the cycle of extinction will begin again. Is there any way we can stop them? There's a data file in my console. Take a copy when you go. When you reach the Citadel's master control unit, upload it to the station. It will corrupt the Citadel's security protocols and give you temporary control of the station. It might give you a chance against Sovereign. Wait, where's the Citadel's master control unit? I'd never heard of anything like that. Through the conduit, follow Saren. He will lead you to your destination. If the Reapers are trapped in dark space, how did Sovereign get here? It is logical to assume the Reapers would leave one of their own behind after each extinction. A sentinel to pave the way for their inevitable return. Hmm. Like those in dark space, Sovereign probably spent most of the last 50,000 years in a state of hibernation. Periodically, it would wake to analyze the situation. Keeping its existence hidden, it would evaluate the state of galactic civilization. And when the time was right, it would signal the Citadel and usher in the next Reaper invasion. Wow. But this time, the signal failed. The Keepers did not respond. Sovereign's allies were trapped in the void. Alone, it was forced to try and discover what had gone wrong. Sovereign's the largest ship in the galaxy. Why all this secret? Why not just attack the Citadel? Sovereign is not invincible. Revealing its true nature would have united the forces of every organic species against it. Even a Reaper couldn't survive such odds. But the Reapers are patient. They will not rush into the unknown. Sovereign could have been planning this for centuries, moving deliberately, gathering allies. Slowly, it has assembled the pieces of the puzzle, working through agents to keep itself hidden. Saren is the most visible pawn of the Reapers, but I doubt he was the first. Now Sovereign has grown bold. Whether from confidence or desperation, I cannot say. But it is determined to reopen the portal to dark space. What about the beacon on Eden Prime? And the one on Vermeer? What were they for? At our apex, the beacons span the breadth of our empire. Ah. We use them as a single galaxy-wide network to transmit data and communications rapidly. So whatever they're getting from it is what world. was left because they weren't able to transmit it, or they were still Virtually transmitting all it. All the beacons were destroyed during the invasion, but once the Reapers were gone, the survivors here on Ilos decided to risk sending out a message. We knew it was unlikely there were other survivors, but if there were, we wanted them to know about Ilos. We wanted to give them hope, so a message was sent across the network. You could have exposed yourself to the Reapers. In truth, we didn't expect any of the beacons would still function, but we had to try. If there were survivors, we had to reach them. The message was meant for our own people. It was coded so only organic beings could interpret it. We still didn't understand the power of Reaper indoctrination. Mm -hmm. We never realized it could lead an agent of the machines, like Saren, to this world. But it has also led you here. So perhaps we did not fail after all. What happened to the survivors from the Conduit Project? They used the Conduit to gain access to the Citadel. But the Conduit is only a prototype. The portal only links in one direction, mm -hmm. so they were trapped on the station. I do not know what became of them then. Wow. It is unlikely they found any food or water on the station. I fear they suffered a slow, grim death. Jeez. 
I only know they succeeded in their mission to seal the relay. Your presence here proves their sacrifice was not in vain. So, when the Reapers created the Citadel, they created the Keepers as well? A more likely scenario is that the Keepers were one of the early harvested civilizations. Perhaps the very first. Perhaps they responded well to indoctrination, or the Reapers simply bred them to be obedient. Wow, case, bruh! They were left behind to operate and maintain the Citadel. But the Keepers are no longer directly controlled by Sovereign or its ilk. They evolved so that they only respond to the signals emitted by the Citadel itself. When the Protheans altered the Citadel signals, they broke Sovereign's hold over the Keepers. Now, they are completely harmless. Sovereign must have realized organic races were difficult to control. A likely hypothesis. The Keepers evolved in an unanticipated direction. Non-organic servants like the Geth would be more predictable. Alright, I think that's it. Saren's got enough of a head start. Grab that data file and let's go. The one you call Saren has not reached the conduit. Not yet. There is still hope if you hurry. Let's go! Yes! I bet you we go out here, we gotta fight. We gotta fight for our lives. Wow. Everybody is dead. I mean, it's been a long periodically time. 50,000 years, I think. It's Earth years. I don't think their plan failed. They, they made it out a little bit. Oh, there's some red. Where? Oh! Got that one off. You're lucky. All those fly noises. I don't like it in my ear. Don't judge me. I didn't know if that was a drop or not. I thought it might have been a ramp. I was incorrect. <laughs> I was incorrect. Oh, wow. I see the dots, but I don't see the people. I can't see. Uh, where? No. No. Whoa! Who the fuck? Is that petty enough? Oops, that's me. I'm kind of stuck a little bit. Jeez, go away. You're dead now. You're dead. You're dead. Whee! I guess they're on the other side of this wall here. Get that repair going. Okay, okay, mm-hmm.
Bro, how did I even see that? Let's talk about that. Um, what, what, what is that? Is that a fire? Oh my gosh, what is that? There, the conduit. It's incredible. We don't have time to admire the view. We have to get through that relay, and these Geth aren't going to make it easy on us. What are we doing? Wow. Wow. Oh, crap. They are really blowing up the Citadel. Trying to make me. Move. Oh, my gosh. No, that's we make it. Wow. Hit him with the vehicle. Yes. Ah, uh, shit, bitch. Get another save down here. I thought they were gonna make it so that we could try to make it there on time, bro. This is not on time. What? Why? I know why, but no. I'm not changing. Everything. <laughs> lost all primary power to the level. Environmental controls are not responding. Class three fires are burning in sectors two, three, six, and seven. Civilian Especially in the war, they're all dead, huh? I am also detecting numerous unauthorized synthetic life forms throughout the station. They are believed to be hostile. Please approach with caution. Okay, ask some questions. What happened to the council? In accordance with standard emergency procedures, the council has been evacuated to the Destiny Ascension. What about Captain Anderson and Ambassador Udina? What happened to them? I have no information on the status of specific hmm. individuals. Once the current crisis has been resolved, a complete accounting of casualties and survivors yeah, I'm gonna bother you. will begin. Where's Saren? I don't know who that the is. Oh! Agent Saren Arturius is near the vicinity of the council chamber. A warrant has been issued for his arrest, though Citadel Security is unable to respond at this time. Come on, we need to stop Saren before it's too late. Please begin emergency evacuation. This is not a drill. Wow. Oh, 
Holy crap. Can we go and stop this dude, please? He's pushing all the buttons. The Citadel's closing. They're sealing the station. Don't let the enemy ships inside the arms. Y'all finna die, ain't y'all? Wow. That's one down. Y'all about to get run through. My gosh. Uh oh. I thought this would be the end of the game. The lies, the deceit. Uh oh. Y'all just gonna let him touch it with his hands? Oh my gosh, look at that sensual. He's clasping it. What are we going to do in here, y'all? Sarah's locked the elevator. Suit up. We're going outside. Ah, shit, bitch. Outside what? Oh, is it floaty? Oh no. There better be a clear destination of where you want my ass to go because I don't know. Yeah, you know, I'm gonna save it myself. Thank you. Have thank you so much. I'm gonna save it myself. Oh, I gotta go down. Ah, I missed! That was my fault. All my fault. Is he not dead? Oh my god, I shot him in the hand. <laughs> I can't remember what the run button is. Otherwise, I would run. Oh shit, it's the runny uppers. Look at that. Hate that they run up on you. It's the absolute worst. See, here's the thing. I'm pushing all the buttons I don't need to push when I'm trying to hit somebody. That's all I was trying to do is figure out how to hit them. And I keep hitting. Oh, it's that button. Can't. Where is he? Did he go down? Oh no! Oh, 
What is going on with this thing? Oh, maybe it's the, the heat thing that I took off. I might have to put one back on there. I can only literally get off two shots before all hell breaks loose with this thing. Where? Shit, I missed. Oh, he's in the air. Yeah, I definitely need to switch to the heat thing in my bobbler. Yeet! Caught that one. Shit, how do you hit me? Okay, hold on. We gotta we gotta fix my sniper. It's that heat sink thing. Um Hmm. Oh, a massive increase in weapons overheating. Oh. Try that. Because that massive increase is killing me. That's better. Get out. Yee. Oh, you got floated. Got him. It means hacked. Oh, did you hack him to fight for us? Because I wasn't sure. He was shooting in my direction. Okay, he was shooting in my direction. gonna go ahead and grab this real quick oh you won't let me what just happened Woo Shoot the ship? Bruh. Sit down. You kidding me? Bruh. Ma'am. Miss. Where are they? Oh, ma'am. from everywhere. Oh, you gotta get the dropship. I wasn't sure if we could shoot the dropship. I don't know what that does. supposed to oh they're shooting it I'm like what are we supposed to do can I climb in this no
Um. You guys, here it comes. Oh, I don't see anybody. That was an accident. Now that I know what button it is, it's kind of, oh no. Shit, I tried to get her. About to die again, girl. The way she be floating, people, bruh. All right, we're gonna do some more. <gasps> Holy shit! Okay. No, sir. No. I just like the way that she just be in the air. Yeet! So, I hate when I take cover. Does that matter? Oh. I, that, that. No! Okay, okay, listen. Do I have to, like... Is there any way for me to, like, undo that? No. She down again? All right, there's one. Fuck! I caught that one right in the face too. You better put me back exactly where I was. Come on. No, I didn't mean to do that. This right here. Yeet! Wow. Wow, that's, that's petty. That's petty, they're flying now. Okay. I did a lot better. Bruh. I missed the hell out of that. I 
I know it would behoove me to take cover. Well, what can she do? What is this? No, no, no. How do I? Hold on. <laughs> Are you kidding me? Stop it. All right, all right, all right. I need you to get down, sweetie. I can't shoot it. It won't let me. Go. Ooh, we got one more. You dead. No, get off the wall. No. Oh. Gosh. Okay, let's say that. Oh, oh wow. Wow. this how damn it shite I love you, but you guys gotta move. Wait, 
wasn't your friend over there, but they both y'all fall. Wow. Ma'am. Behind us. I was afraid you wouldn't make it in time, Shepard. In time for what? The final confrontation. I think I need to get him off his hover I don't even know what to call it a hoverboard. This nigga got a hover podium. In a few minutes, Sovereign will have full control of all the Citadel systems. The relay will open, the Reapers will return. I've still got a few tricks up my sleeve. You survived our encounter on Vermeyer, but I've changed since then. Improved. Sovereign has upgraded me. You let Sovereign implant you? Are you insane? I suppose I should thank you, Shepard. After Vermeyer, I couldn't stop thinking about what you said. About Sovereign manipulating me. About indoctrination. The doubts began to eat away at me. Wow. Sovereign sensed my hesitation. I was implanted to strengthen my resolve. Now my doubts are gone. I believe in Sovereign completely. I understand that the Reapers need organics. Join us, and Sovereign will find a place for you, too. Sovereign's controlling you through your implants. Don't you see that? The relationship is symbiotic. Uh -huh. Organic and machine intertwined. A union of flesh and steel. The strengths of both, the weaknesses of neither. I am a vision of the future, Shepard. The evolution of all organic life. This is our destiny. Join Sovereign and experience a true rebirth. Sovereign hasn't won yet. I can stop it from taking control of the station. Step aside and the invasion will never happen. We can't stop it. Not forever. You saw the visions. You saw what happened to the Protheans. The Reapers are too powerful. Some part of Business. you must still realize this is wrong. You can fight this. Maybe you're right. Maybe there is still a chance for... For... <laughs> No! Fight it! The implants. Sovereign is too strong. I'm sorry. It is too late. Use your strength from the inside pieces. It's not over yet. You can still redeem yourself. You, you're doing a little too much. Redeem? Thank you. I think not. Is he still moving though? He's dead right there. Him and his uh, hover podium. Vigil's data file worked. I've got control of all systems. Quick, open the station's arms. Maybe the fleet can take Sovereign down before he regains control of the station. See if you can open a communications channel. The Destiny Ascension. Main drives offline. Kinetic barriers down 40%. The Council is on board. I repeat, the Council is on board. Normandy to the Citadel. Normandy to the Citadel. Please tell me that's you, Commander. It is, baby. I'm here, Joker. We caught that distress call, Commander. I'm sitting here in the Endura sector with the entire Arcturus fleet. We can save the Ascension. Just unlock the relays around the Citadel and we'll send the cavalry in. You'd sacrifice human lives to save the Council? What have they ever done for your kind? <laughs> this is bigger than humanity. Sovereign's a threat Truth. to every organic species in the galaxy. That's why you can't throw away reinforcements trying to save the council. Hold them back until the Citadel arms open up and the human fleet can go Don't make me stop. choose. What's the order, Commander? Fuck. Now to save the Ascension or hold back?
Opening the relays now, Joker. We need to save the Ascension, no matter what the cost. I hope the Council appreciates this. They fucking better. They better. Alliance ships, move in. Save the Destiny Ascension. They fucking better. Commander, we're picking up reinforcements. It's the Alliance. Thank the Goddess. It's better not sacrifice my Joker. I mean it. Jeez. look like is it a squid he finna get up ain't he make sure he's dead he not he finna get up uh oh Okay. I don't like this cutscene. He finna pop up, ain't he? He's dead. No, he's not. He finna pop his ass up. This is Thriller. Should've lit him on fire. He. Good grief. So now I gotta fight the Sovereign in what your faces body. Actually have to look at him. Didn't even work, huh? What does that do? Shit. Oh my gosh, she keeps jumping. This is the wrong gun, but I like it. Can anybody do stasis again? Can I do stasis? No, no. I don't know what this does. Oh shit, jammed? What? After I use it, of course.
shit. No, bitch. Um, I don't know what that does. No, no, no. Yes. He shields up. Shit. Did you get his ass? Please get these little ones. I'm trying to get somebody to. Yes! Friggin' shield recharged. Hold on, can I look at my equipment real quick? Yes, great, 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 great. The assault rifle has more. Shooting somebody behind us? I wish you would not auto like crouch. Where is he? What's happening? Um, who is that? Who is that? That was not the Normandy, right? Someone's too strong. We have to pull back. Joker. Negative. This is our Joker. Chance. Take that monster down, no matter Joker. what the cost. Joker. Sweetie. There's people everywhere. All of her stuff is recharging. Oops, wrong button. I know I hit your ass. Bullshit. Are you? Wow. Get out of here. All right. Shit! 
ate the hell out of that. No, get off the rocks, please. Yeah, I don't know what just happened, but it was great. his hoppity hoppity ass anybody Shittery. Oh my god, there's so many little people! And they're friggin' shields! Okay. Damn, it can't use stasis, huh? I don't know what that does, but we're gonna use it. Switch guns. Gosh, this is a long ass fight. No, get off of that wall. All right, shield is down. Where the fuck he go? Shit. Are you kidding me? Can I can I aim please? Shit. through his damn shield again. Where you at? Oh, 
Okay. Mm. Oh my god, he's so close to being dead! This dude is hopping the fuck around. My shield's almost down. Give me my gun! God damn! Oh, got him. Jesus. Wow. That was a long ass fight. Wow. Um, his pieces flying in the vicinity, ma'am. Ma'am, there are pieces. What is that? Why are we looking at that? Oh! Go. I'm fine, right? <laughs> I'm okay, right? Is I okay? Is we okay? Bro, where we at? <clears throat> Captain Anderson, we found him. They're in here. Captain Anderson? Take it easy. It's over. You're safe now. Where's the commander? What you mean, where's the commander? My nigga, where am I? Lies and deceit. They heard AF too. Okay, good. I'm like, bruh, there is no way that my character is deceased. Because if I had to make a new character, she was going to be completely new. Okay, we're not doing the braids, okay? <laughs> I have to rename her, too. Look at me. Look at me. Yes! Yes! Ambassador? Captain? When y'all gonna listen to me now? Bitch. We have gathered here to recognize the enormous contributions of the Alliance forces. You're welcome. The Sovereign and the Geth. Many humans lost their lives in the battle to save the Citadel. Brave and courageous soldiers who willingly gave their lives so that we, the Council, might live. There is no greater sacrifice. And we share your grief over the tragic loss of so many noble men and women. 
council also owes you a great personal uh -huh. honor, one we can never repay. Beach. You saved not just our lives, but the lives of billions from Sovereign and the Reapers. Commander Shepard, your heroic and selfless actions serve as a symbol of everything humanity and the Alliance stand for. Are you gonna call me a super specter now or some shit? No, we cannot bring back those valiant soldiers who gave their lives to save ours. We can honor their memories through our actions. Humanity has shown it is ready to stand as a defender and protector of the galaxy. You have proved you are worthy to join our ranks and serve beside us on the Citadel Council. Counselor, on behalf of Humanity and the Alliance, we thank you for this prestigious honor and humbly accept- Can we not take him? We need a list of potential candidates- Not him. Humanity Anderson. Given all that has happened, I am sure your recommendation will carry a- Anderson. Commander. Do you support any particular candidate? We need someone with the courage to stand up for what he believes you in. You thought I thought I was going- Someone like Captain Anderson. Him? You must be joking. Anderson prefers to let his fists do the talking. And them fists made the work. you, Ambassador. Only with you. Uh. Are you sure about this, Commander? No. The uh -uh. Captain's a soldier, not a politician. We've already got too many politicians on the Citadel. The Captain would be perfect for this job. I think it's an inspired choice. The council would welcome him with open arms. <laughs> like, yes, sick of him. I'm honored, Counselor. As humanity's representative, I'll do everything in my power to help the council rebuild. Sovereign's defeat marks the beginning of a new era for both humanity and the council. Sovereign was only a vanguard. The Reaper fleet is still coming. Hundreds of ships, maybe thousands. And I'm going to find some way to stop them. I got things to do. Shepard's right. Humanity is ready to do its part. United with the rest of the Council, we have the strength to overcome any challenge. When the Reapers come, we must stand side by side. We must fight against them as one. And together, we will drive them back into dark space. This is so good. Bruh. Bruh. I feel like I need some Avengers music. Right here. For this zoom in right here, this close up zoom in, even though I'm looking at the sky like, Jesus, that, that right there. It's so good. And we only lost one person, Ashley. Mm -mm -mm. And I got laid. Yes. That's so good. That is so good, it's so good. I cannot, well, I can't believe because during the time this came out, I was more into reading. And what, what did this come out exactly? Let me see what year it was. Because if it was anywhere in my college, there was no way I was playing it. Oh yeah. That came out in 2007. Bro, that was my college years. I wasn't playing no games. I played Halo and then I stopped and I played liquor. That was my college game. It was sex and liquor. So <laughs> I'm so glad I got a chance to play this. This was a really good game. The story was great. It was just a lot of fun. I don't think there's anything at the end, right? Is there anything at the end? Because I didn't want to keep that song playing because, you know, copyright. But the game was really fun. The story was engaging. Um, of course, the controls, they weren't wonky, but it's just that I get so used to pushing the same buttons that I don't explore the weapon wheel. And that last battle was the most I have ever used biotics, period. <laughs> I was healing and stasis in left and right. <laughs> but I had a blast in this. Thanks guys for all the, the tips and the hints and the look arounds and, and, and just trying to like make sure I get the most out of this. I do appreciate it. 
and of course you know I'm gonna finish out the series. I don't know about Andromeda, but I am gonna finish two and three, and um, yeah. I've got no complaints. No complaints. This is pretty fun. Well, you know, like cosmetics, like I wish I had more hairs, but you know, but you know, we still have that trouble right now in 2021 with regular games. I'm not gonna complain about a game that was made in 2007. Okay, cool. But on that note, guys, thanks for hanging with me and hopefully I will catch you in the next one. And of course, it's gonna be Mass Effect 2. Bye. Oh, this is great. I have fun. I like it.